It's Umsum time. Why does a camel have a hump? A camel's hump is like a built-in energy backpack. It stores fat, not water, which the camel can use as fuel when food is scarce. When the camel uses the stored fat, the hump shrinks and might even flop huh? to one side until it fills up again. Hmm. The hump also helps camels stay cool by keeping most of their body fat in one spot, allowing the rest of their body to stay cooler. Hmm. Why does our cough get worse at night? Firstly, when we lie down, gravity causes mucus to accumulate in our throat, leading to irritation and triggering the cough reflex. Secondly, acid reflux may occur more frequently at night, as lying flat can allow our stomach acid to travel upward, thus irritating our throat. Thirdly, the body's reduced ability to suppress coughing during sleep makes the problem worse. Lastly, dry indoor air can also contribute, causing additional throat irritation and thus coughing during the night. Hmm. <laughs> How high do commercial planes fly? Commercial airplanes fly at altitudes ranging between 30,000 to 36,000 feet above the sea level. Firstly, flying at such an altitude places the airplane in the lower stratosphere of planet Earth. Lower stratosphere is located above the clouds. This helps in protecting the airplane against bad weather. Secondly, the air in the lower stratosphere is much thinner as compared to the air near the surface of the Earth. Thinner the air, lesser the resistance for the airplane. This results in higher fuel efficiency for the airplane. Hmm. Why do we snore? Snoring occurs when air struggles to move freely through our nose and throat during sleep, causing the surrounding tissues to vibrate. This happens for various reasons. Firstly, nasal congestion from allergies or colds can block the airway. Secondly, when we sleep on our back, our tongue may block the airway. Thirdly, excess weight can add pressure to our neck, thus narrowing the airway. Lastly, age also plays a role, as throat muscles weaken over time, thus making snoring likely. Hmm. Why does a ship float on water? A ship floats on water due to a principle known as buoyancy. Buoyancy is the upward force exerted by a fluid, in this case, water, that opposes the weight of an immersed object, in this case, the ship. Ships are designed to displace a volume of water equal to their weight. When the weight of the water displaced is equal to or greater than the weight of the ship, the ship floats. This principle allows even very large and heavy ships to stay afloat. Mm. What if we were as slow as a tortoise? No big deal. I'm some is the slowest. No, oh, I'm some. If we were as slow as a tortoise, bosses would be extremely unhappy. Hmm. Marathons would become extremely, extremely boring. Hmm. Building a house may now take decades. Hmm. Even sloths may start doing things faster than us. Hmm. Husbands may have to wait forever for wives to complete their makeup. People may drive extremely slowly. Traffic cops may have no work left to do. Hmm. Thieves will now get easily caught by cops. Hmm. Building muscles in a gym may now take a long, long time. 
Hmm. People may start getting extremely, extremely late for meetings. Hmm. Aliens may never visit planet Earth again. Hmm. What if we had two suns? That would be super cool. Huh? Huh? Oh, um, some. If we had two suns, sale of air conditioners will definitely skyrocket. Hmm. Both suns huh? may start pulling Earth towards each other. Earth may get exhausted. Hmm. Winters will now be a thing huh? of the past. Hmm. All the glaciers may now melt. Water levels will rise everywhere. Hmm. People who love cold temperatures may start living inside refrigerators. Mercury, the closest planet to the sun, may no longer survive. Hmm. They may start fighting with each other. Entire solar system may suffer. Hmm. Summers will now get super hot. We may start sweating buckets. Hmm. Comets who orbit around the sun may now get extremely confused. Hmm. Sale of sunscreen and sunglasses may skyrocket. Hmm. What if Earth turned into a desert? No big deal. Um, some is always super comfortable. Oh, um, some. If Earth turned into a desert, people who love cold places may start staying inside refrigerators. Huh? Mm. <laughs> Polar bears will definitely leave for a different planet. Hmm. Sellers of summer clothes may suddenly start driving expensive cars. Hmm. There is a lot of sand in deserts. We may need to clean our house all day long. Hmm. Day and night temperatures in huh? deserts vary a lot. We may need different clothing <laughs> for both of them. Huh? Hmm. Dust storms huh? are common in deserts. Huh? Our houses may not last long. Huh? <laughs> hmm. People who suffer from herpetophobia, as in fear of reptiles, may shift to a different planet. <laughs> hmm. Water may become more valuable than gold. Hmm. People who are used to taking long baths huh? may have to be satisfied with a single bucket of water. Mm. Deserts are extremely hot. We may start sweating buckets. Huh? 